It's showtime! Hey, yo, what up, Fight Worship? We're Boxer Fanatic. I'm back with another one. So, the WBC has approved Devin Haney to move up and fight at 140 pounds to challenge the champion and Regis Progre for his WBC belt. However, Shakur Stevenson will have a chance to fight for Devin Haney WBC lightweight championship belt at 135 pounds. Hey yo, what up you guys? It's your boy Boxing Fanatic, back with some more boxing. Make sure you smash that like button. Don't forget to subscribe for the latest and greatest content. So, however, Devin Haney would be stripped of his WBC belt and will be moved down to champion in recess. So, which means Shakur Stevenson will have a chance to challenge for the 135-pound lightweight championship belt. And who that opponent is that's next in line, I think that is Lomachenko. Because Lomachenko is still the calling out a lot of champions at 135 pounds but no one seemed to want to get in the ring with him or either just even sign the contract and we know Shakur Stevenson he calling out everyone and he want all the smoke with everybody but no one seemed to want to get in the ring Devin Haney and Regis Progre this fight looked like it's set for October 26 real soon just waiting on Regis Prograde to sign the contract. Devin Haney, these were his words that was coming out of Devin Haney's mouth. And now that the WBC has stepped in and approved that Devin Haney can go up to 140 pounds up, which he just got approved from the WBC. And so Devin Haney. Everybody was saying that he was ducking the smoke with Shakur Stevenson. No, that's just not the case. I think he trying to do the same thing what Terrence Crawford just did. He became the first male to in the four belt era to collect all four belts and be undisputed in two different weight classes. One at 140 pounds and one at 147 pounds and the other to be up on that list. So who has the belts at? 140 pounds. Regis Progre, Teofimo Lopez has two belts, and Roley has a belt. And I think uh, Regis Progre is signed with the zone and Eddie Hearns, so that fight is easily to be made and money to be made. And the, the check is going to be right for Regis Progre because I know he's not making the kind of money Devin Haney is making, so I'm pretty sure he can't, you know, price Eddie Hearns will oblige him that purse that he want and that he's looking for so let's see if you know they can get on one page one accord just to make this fight happen not just for themselves but for the fans and prove to everybody that uh regis can prove that he still you know is a champion and that Devin haney can't be him but i beg the difference i think so um yeah he can't he can't come in there trying to outbox Devin haney that ain't gonna work he about to stick to his game plan to what he normally do. And that's, you know, try to, I guess, frustrate the opponent. But he can't do that with Devin Haney. Uh, I think that fight will pretty much go the way the fight looked last week. I love Terrence Crawford. I love Earl Spence. But uh, I think Regis Progre will be steps behind like Earl Spence. And that's just my honest opinion. But um, y'all let me know how y'all feel about Devin Haney and, Sh and uh, Regis Progre and Shakur Stevenson challenging for uh, Devin Haney WBC belt. And the WBC has moved and stripped Devin Haney of his WBC, WBC belt and says that he's a, a champion in recess. Y'all let me know what y'all think, all right? Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. One love, one life. I'm out. Peace. If you enjoy content like this and you want to see more, Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe.